This year, Queen Elizabeth Earl II celebrated 70 years on the throne and stands as the second longest reigning monarch in history. During the early days of her reign, however, the monarch herself questioned if the firm would uphold, following a period of unpopularity amongst the public. Royal experts discussed the Queen's early feelings towards the monarchy on Channel 4's new royal documentary, The Real Windsors. The documentary claimed that people started attacking Queen Elizabeth Rose II for being out of touch. Speaking on The Real Windsors, royal historian Robert Lacey said, We know that the Queen herself was worried in these years about people's opinions of herself and the way she was doing her job. There's even a quote at this time from someone who spoke to the Queen. I mean, she's reported to have said, totally flippantly, that she very much whether the monarchy, the system herself, would still be in business in five years' time. Also speaking in the documentary, political strategist Alastair Campbell said, her people will say to you that she understands that if you get to a point where the public doesn't have any interest in you, respect for you, then the monarchy ceases to exist. They do rely on that sense of public support. The Queen became the longest reigning British monarch on September 9, 2015. On this date, she surpassed the reign of her great-great-grandmother Victoria.